Somebody, somebody here, Cade. Need some help, bud? Left hander again. Double! Oh, 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 oh. That's a boom. You're watching the number one adventure show, Hooked on Utah, powered by Ford. Hey, welcome to Hooked on Utah. You know what, today, we're in one of my favorite places with some of my favorite people. We got Ashley from Addictive Fishing. We got Braden. We got my boy, Paul's boy. We're up here on Flaming Gorge. We're gonna chase some kokanee salmon. Should be a ton of fun. Ash has been knocking them dead, so with any luck, these guys will put some big fish in the boat. So sit back and relax and enjoy today's adventure. Stacker onto the main line. Out. Yep, pull it down. Now reel. There you go. He's hooked, so you don't have to hook him. Nice right, fish on. First fish of the day. I did it. I fish on. Fish on. We've only been fishing for a couple of minutes. You know, the hardest part about this for Ashley is he's got to do a lot of work. He just got everything rigged. Yep. And he's bam, fish on. This is what's so cool about Ashley's guiding service. The fishing is always excellent, whether it's lake trout, oh, coke, yeah. bass. Yeah. We got a laker. We got a laker. Oh, and he's headed back down. That is so awesome. Look yeah. at that. Oh. Oh. Good, good one. Good. All right. Keep it That's tight, all right. Rooksy. We'll get another Rooksy, one. when you're we'll reeling, there, if right. you pump like this and then bring the rod down, yeah. you give it you give it a lot of slack, so just reel, okay? With these light tips, bud, you can just let them play off that tip. See how light that is? Mm -hmm. Just hold that rod tip up and just keep reeling. Come here, buddy, come here. Mm -hmm. Here you go, grab that rod and just start reeling, start reeling. There you go, reel. Bud. There you go. It'll help you if you hold this rod clear up here. Holy cow, he's taking line, dude. Don't let him pull you over. You got a hold over, dude? <laughs> okay, let's let's get your e position here, dude. Put that rod just like that. There you go. You got her, Dad. You know this Rod's is what's right so there. much fun, folks, about bringing your little kids fishing. He's um, he's oh, battling boy. a nice little fish here. And on this good equipment, it makes it easier for him to land land a fish. But this is Cade's first big fish, and uh, he's doing great. Doing awesome! It's so much, so exciting. This will get him so addicted to fishing, right here. That <laughs> fish is giving you a workout. <coughs> Keep him coming, bud. Braiding the net, man. Can you get her done? It's on the net, boy. Yeah. Hey, hey. <clears throat> Look at that. Hey! Good job. Woo! Whoa, that's good a job. Good job, Look at that kokanee salmon. Huh? Wow. Have you ever caught a salmon? I have no idea. You have no, no. idea? No, I'll bet I that's know. your first salmon, dude. Yeah. That's a landlocked sockeye. Well, this is the best kokanee fishery in the country. Do you know that? No. Pretty cool, ain't it? No. You want to hold him up for a good picture? No. No? You want to no. kiss him or anything? Oh. I need to. Yes! Crispy crab dog good! Right, In your side right there? Yeah. Then you can kind of yeah. reel on him. Then you got a little bit of control if you're trying to hold that rod. If you're trying to hold that rod clear back here, you can't you go in like this. So if you get it like that, you can. Oh, look at that. <laughs> 
real. Real, 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 real. Now don't pump it. Take your time. Take your time, Bronco. Bronco, take hey, your time. Hey, out of the water. <laughs> Bronco's a bass fisherman. He's going to try to just horse this thing straight. Bronco, just reel. Just reel. Yep, just keep it nice and smooth, bud. You're doing good. All right. Oh! oh. Yo ho! Hey. Oh, that a boy, Braden. Good job, guys. Oh, I hear another fish, right on. The the fish on. Fish on. Fish on. Gear used on this week's adventure can be found at your local Sportsman's Warehouse or online at sportsmanswarehouse.com. Ash, we had a great time fishing today. People are going to ask, okay, what's a good basic setup and some basic tackle for me so I can go out? and uh, try this on Flaming Gorge. Right now I'm running the Velocity Rods and I'm, I'm just topping them off with an Abu Garcia reel. They're very affordable. You can go to Sportsman's Warehouse, pick them up for pretty cheap. Now I'm topping them off with a, a 12 pound uh, fluorocarbon line. And, and you know, the Dodger selections, the, people get confused. There's so many different variations, colors, sizes. Something that I can tell people is key in on the smaller stuff earlier in the season, move on as the fish get more aggressive this time of the year as they start to change, go to the bigger stuff. Maybe put a little bend in it, um, they'll come straight. There's little things that you can do there. But have a good variety of squid and, and, and have squid with, with flashers, um, with some of the spinners on them. Um, Sometimes these leaders are going to break as we fish with them, so I always want to make sure I've got some fluorocarbon leaders so that I can retie those. And I'll always have an assortment of gamagatsu hooks, which I can pick up right at Sportsman's Warehouse, and I can retie these leaders as needed. As you've seen today, we broke a couple leaders off. I've got all that stuff right there. Now I can reuse those squid over and over and over. I'll use the same squid for two or three years in a row. Awesome. Head down to Sportsman's Warehouse, get geared up, and we'll see you right here at Flaming Gorge. Good job, guys. Oh, oh, I hear another fish right on. The back of the boat. Fish, fish on. on. Fish on. Red rod, red rod, the red one. Dude, there's, there's one on this close one, too. Yeah, There's one on the green, green rod. No, he's on that red one. Wow. He jumped at two feet at the boat. Yeah. <laughs> he comes straight up? Straight up. Look at this. This is so fun for the kids, folks, right here. Coming up here, I'll tell you what, you'll, you will not have a better experience with anybody other than Ashley and addictive fishing. This is what gets kids going right here. I mean, we're trying to bring in a fish. The trolling motor's barely moving. Ashley's uh, finagle in the boat and it is fish on, you know, beautiful kokanee salmon. Nice coat. Fun. Fun. It's really fun. What would it, it feel like when you're fighting? I won't call the it video. was hard and it felt good. Yeah, it was really pulling, wasn't it? Yeah. It's your birthday the other day, huh? Yes. How old are you? Eight. Eight years old. So for his birthday, he's coming salmon fishing with Ashley. You got your first big, maybe four pound salmon. Pretty cool, huh? Yeah. High five it. I love the clarity of the lenses. They're like, especially later in the afternoons when it's starting to get darker. These things still keep everything so bright that I, I love them. So if you'll yeah. go to Haber Vision's website and if you type in the code hooked, you're going to go from paying, uh, you know, 160 bucks or 200 bucks for a pair of glasses. 50% off right there immediately. Even when you're looking in the water at fish coming up, the clarity of, of even through the water is just amazing. You can see those big lakers coming up. I can see them, you know, 10, 15 feet before my clients can. He's coming up, bud. Yeah, Braden. Coming on up. Talk to me, Braden. What's going on? Got a fish on. I'll let him pass the boat. Flaming Gorge guide in training. He's uh, he's Ashley's first mate, and you've seen him before on bike. our uh, burbot shows. He knows what he's doing. That's beautiful. Ooh, nice. Really good coke, bud. I'm gonna buzz right back through there. There was quite a few fish right there. There was fish, and I didn't think he was on anymore, but he, he come out of 48 foot of water, huh, dude? Wow. Braden, good job, buddy. I mean, they're not a huge fighter or anything like that. Oh, red, red, 
Fish on, Brooks is on. Nice. Just keep it tight, Brooks. Hey! Keep it tight. Don't jerk the rod. Don't pulse the rod. Just Something that'll don't. help Braden, bud, and help you jump down here and then keep that rod up, and then you can fight that fish from anywhere in the boat. That rod tip gets clear out there, and Braden, your little arms ain't wrong enough to reach it, so keep that rod tip up. So you can keep that rod tip up and let him fight that. Hey, 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 teamwork. Look at that, that's a big old fatty. What do you think, how was it? It was fun. Fight good? Yeah. It's been pretty fast action. Mm -hmm. We have Brooks and Cade who had birthdays last week. Wow. Brooks turned 12 and Caden turned 25. Yeah, I turned 25. Red, red, okay, red. Okay. All right, I'll get it. All right, Grab Cade. it, dude. Slide that rod out, Caden. Hang on to it tight. <laughs> or just leave it in the rod holder if that's easier. That work? You got him. This is hard. That's hard. Look at that kokanee. Just keep doing it. All right, stop reeling. Good job, dude. Oh, look at the size of that cave. <laughs> wow. Dude, that's a monster. What do you think, dude? That's, that's the biggest one yet. You think so? Yep. Show everybody yeah. this, this freshwater oh. shark you just caught. Mm. Just pinch his tail right there. Squeeze it hard. Check this out. <laughs> awesome, dude. Second fish, tell me what you think. Sweet. It's sweet. I've never caught a bigger fish than that. Never. Red pull up, Bronco. Pull it out and start okay, reeling. Here. Pop it off that downrigger. Reel. There you go. Okay, now just reel steady. Reel steady. Steady reeling. Just steady. Don't jerk the rod. Just nice and steady. There we go. Good job. Braden and Bronco right there. Keep reeling, Bronco. Don't go slack. Keep it tight so you don't lose him. Oh, Lake look trail. Look at that. Oh, that's a... Uh, Lake, uh, Lake, uh, Lake, uh. Keep it tight, Bronco. Rod tip up. Keep that tip up in the air. Keep your rod tip up, Bronco. Is it fighting more than a kokanee? In the net. Oh. Awesome. Oh. Look at that. Lake trout. Oh, Baby wow. Laker. Wow. That is beautiful. Uh -huh. See all those colors? Wow. Can I let go? Are we letting go? Now normally we'd keep these because there's so many in the reservoir, but today we're just going to chase these cokes, so we're going to let him go. So do you want to throw him over? Yeah. Go ahead and slide him right back in. Oh. Atta boy. Hey, you know what? This is what is so much fun about taking little kids out and doing something like this. The biggest thing is when you get kids out, you get them with a guide and you, they catch fish, they will truly be hooked for life. Fishing is fun for adults, even if the catching is slow, but it's not so much for the kids. They need to catch. And that's why coming up with Ashley, whether it is burbot fishing, lake trout fishing, kokanee trout, he's, he's one of the best people I know, the best guide, period. And you and your kids, sons, daughters will have an incredible time. Book a trip, you'll have the time of your life. Get our hand wet, pick them up, take that hook out, and then we can get them right back in. That's a little guy we didn't want to keep. Yep, we awesome. want to try to keep Good some job. bigger ones. Oh, fish, we just popped off. Hey, guys. Who's up? Who's up? Fish on, baby. How do you like this kokanee fishing, Brooks? Tell people about it. It's like you have to try. It's so much fun. Ashley's a really nice guy. It's like you've done this before. I have. I thought today was your first day. No. That'll work, huh? Fish sticks for dinner. Me. Keep it tight. Now keep that rod tip up, Bronco. Oh my God. Me. Nice little red. Talk to me, Bronco. Oh man, it's got a lot. <laughs> How's he doing, Braden? Good. Oh. 
Keep your rod tip up in the air, Bronco. You act like it's shark. <laughs> <laughs> it is. It is. It's a big one. Get that rod tip up in the air now. Back up, Bronco. Oh, Step that back. Is big. Wow. That's maybe our biggest one yet. Oh, oh, come on, that boy. Swing him in. Swing him in. Oh, oh, and he makes it in. Oh. <laughs> Woo. Oh, yeah, yeah, the hook just. I, 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 and I feel something. I'm like, I got him, but I don't got him right. <laughs> I went to go net the fish and the hook the got caught in the net and, and he was still out. Quick kiss, Bronco. And now, oh. Bronco. <laughs> You're going to get fish slapped on the next one. Like that? Bronco. All right, here we go. Rod, red rod, both rods. We're doubled. We're doubled. Oh, We're double, 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 double. Cage, double, cage, get it, cage, get it, get cage. it. Somebody, somebody here, Cage. Need some help, bud. Okay. Left hander again. We're done. Okay, we gotta go. You gotta go this way. There you go. That's okay. Awesome, awesome. We're doubled up here. I can see Kate's fish back there. Brooks, ooh, Brooks, he's coming. There you go. That's okay. Awesome, awesome. We're doubled up here. I can see Kate's fish back there. Brooks, ooh, Brooks, he's got a big one. Rod tip up. Double! Oh, 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 look at mine. Ooh, 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 oh, ooh. Oh, ooh, That's ooh. a toad coconut. Oh, keep. Oh, dude. That is oh a freaking gosh, monster a of a coke. Okay, come up over this way, bud. Okay, real? I got Cade. <laughs> Here, Cade, I got you real. Good point. Where do you want it? <laughs> All right. Oh, oh, look at this. Look at Brooks, this is a giant. Ooh. That's like four pounds. That is a couple oh. of smoker cokes right there. Dang nice cokes. Good job, you guys. Hey, what do you guys think? I think I think these are giants. <laughs> is it not awesome. super fun fishing with Ashley? Yeah. yeah, you better get out here with him. Yeah. Before it's too late. Got to do it before September 10th. That's when the kokanee season closes okay. this year. You ready to put him in here yeah. and catch another? This guy right here is the guy that caused all this. <laughs> that's mom and he dad. Got, right there. He got me hooked on fishing when I was these guys' age, and that's why I am where I am today, because of them. Let's see your hands now. Show me. <laughs> Show me your hands. Are they clean? All right, yeah. you're ready. <laughs> we asked him back to work. And he's working hard just getting the rods rigged and reset and stacking them up and back. And it makes it so fun for the kids because they just catch, reel in, net, enjoy that whole experience, and he's back to work again. You know, Ashley, when people go fishing, one of the big things that happens is they catch fish. They just don't know how to fillet them. Their fillets don't turn out. They waste a lot of meat. Can you walk us through a quick technique on how to do this? You guys, we're going to follow the structure of the fish. So I'm going to cut him down right to that, you can feel a spine right there. So now I'm just going to take the tip of that knife and kind of angle it down along that spine. Now as I go in to right here to where that dorsal fin is, right at that about midway through that dorsal fin, I can actually poke my knife right through to these anal fins and I can follow that spine. Now once I get to there, I can flip that up, so if I angle that knife down, I can pop those Y bones and I can follow that down. A lot of people will cut those ribs off right there and then have to clean this up later. And I like to just take it all off right there and do it nice and slow. So what I'll do is I'll just trim this belly fat up a little bit. Once I get that trimmed down to there, I'm just going to start back here, follow along this until I get to there. I'm going to notch this fin out, and I can just pull that off, and there's your nice clean fillet. Folks, I hope you've enjoyed today's adventure. You know what, every time we come fishing with you, Ashley, whether it's burbot, lake trout, bass, or kokanee, we have a heck of a time. How can people get a hold of you if they want to bring their kids up and experience this kind of fast, fun uh, action? 
you can look us up at www.flaminggorgefishing.com right here um, or call us at 307-389-8160 and we'll uh, try to work out a package deal where you can if you want to come out and do a mixed combo wakers and cokes we can do that or kokanee and rainbows or ling and uh, smaller lake trout we, we can mix it up make it however folks want it but the most important thing about like the kokanee season it's all about these guys you know yeah. all about these kids it's it's a great great thing as you've seen today we can take our kids out and just have a good time and relax and and come back and everybody's got fish for the smoker. Absolutely. If you want to bring your sons and daughters up, have an incredible time, get a hold of Ashley. Remember, same time, same channel, whole new fishy adventure next week. <laughs>